Welcome everyone, welcome to a new let's play. Well, maybe it's gonna be a let's play, we don't know yet. Depends on how everyone is going to like this. It's seven days to die, and uh, yeah, it's a zombie survival open world game. Hey, we haven't seen that before, but I don't know, I'm, I'm guilty of that. I like it, <clears throat> I like this sort of stuff, as long as it's well done. Uh, game world, chunk persistence, general offline adventure. <clears throat> Persistent profiles. Players must keep their profile they first connected with when set to on. Oh, this is more like multiplayer stuff. 24 hour cycle, 60 minutes, 14 hours. Basic. Wow, there's a lot of stuff here. Kill strangers only? Yeah, we're not doing that. Okay, we're just gonna... Wait, why can't I start? Oh, because I already... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let me... Let me get rid of this one. Because I already tried it for a little bit. Uh, let's just do it like this. Start game. <clears throat> Harvesting resources. Harvest resources such as trees, rocks and more using your fists with the left mouse button. Tools are much faster and yield higher amounts of resources. Alright. Apparently this game was in development for, what, 10 years? I think it was 10 years. It was quite a long time. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see how we go. And we'll see, you know. Um, let me know down in the comments below. I hope you're actually hearing what I'm saying. You're ready to spawn in the world. Let's spawn. Building environment. Why you couldn't do that before? While you... <laughs> okay, oh, jeez. Yeah, let me know down in the comments below uh, after you watch this video about what you think about it. If you'd like to see more. Because I'm not going to play a game that people might dislike. What is that? Rotting flesh. I don't... Ugh. Brass and iron. Okay. So I've put the... Yeah. Uh, graphically... What is this? Sniper volume 5. Can I use this? Hey. Assuming there's 15 less stamina. Okay. Untouched. Some nails. I don't know what we use this all for, but we're going to find out. There's a house here. Oh, so it's not procedurally generated because this house looks the same as it did before. Looks cool, though. I mean... Dysentery, max stamina bonus, health. So you can actually eat this. Ugh. An ordinary bone from an animal, probably. Can I use the bones for anything? I don't know. I've enjoyed uh, Project Zomboid, for example, a lot. It's uh, it's a lot of fun to play, especially in multiplayer. If you play it with someone, with a friend, or you know, um, and I do recommend it. It's it's really excellent, and it's come very far. That's a mod. How is this light still working? That's... This is a weird house. Where's the rest of it? We came upstairs. Let's see downstairs. Whoa, going downstairs is a... Is an interesting thing. I guess someone was here? What's with the music? Food pile. That's what we need. Murky water and can of dog food. Yummy murky water. Mm -mm. Apparently you can get dysentery. Okay. Dishwasher. Iron. Spoiled trash. It's not immediately clear what you can uh, what you can pick up or search through and what you can't. Oh, potato. There's a bit of a delay after the search is complete, and it's kind of annoying. More murky water. Mm -mm. We're getting XP for uh, finding stuff. Ugh. All right. What else do we got? Oh, hello. Oh, it's a zombie. Uh, the, how do I? I don't think this is the best weapon. Oh, it's still alive. Yeah, there you go. 
Okay, good. I can't loot her. She wasn't making any sounds and she didn't care that I was there. Or she didn't hear me, I don't know. Or maybe they're not as um, active throughout the day. That's also a possibility. Bones and lead. We, we can probably make boats or something. Fancy toilet. Some murky water. Mm -mm. Oh, medicine cabinet. Got scrap polymers. Alright. Cannot get out there. Can I do anything with the fire? Wait, pick a potted plant. Why would I want to pick up the potted plant? No idea. Do we have any mail? We do. Insulated liner mod schematic. Okay, let's use that. And learn to outfit your shop with forges, workbenches, cement mixers, and chemistry stations. That's cool. Seems to be a lot of stuff you can build. Untouched. Open challenges window. Oh, I have to do that. A wheel. What? And radiator. Can you actually use these? Crafting a vehicle. Interesting. Alright, so press Y. Press the redeem button below or press W to redeem your first challenge reward. Why is it such random buttons? Why is it W on this and then A on... Whoa. Press... Left mouse button to punch grass, shrubs, and small stones. Look for yellow navigation icons to find resources. Okay. I need ten of them. There we go. Small stones. Let's get the small stones. Well, I'll tell you what. Um, sort of the feel of it, mechanics-wise, and the look of it, it certainly does feel like a 10-year-old game. Or like a game that was... that started development 10 years ago. Um, plant fibers. What do we got? Plant fibers. What is that? Crushed sand. Crushed sand is a core resource that can be resor uh, smelted in the forge to make glass and used to craft items. Okay, makes sense. Purse. Money. What would I use this for? It's mostly valued for being made of paper. Some more chicken soup. What is that? Rocket launcher parts. Okay. Clay. That could be useful. Pink SUV. Who buys a pink SUV? Brass, wood. We're getting a lot of this stuff, so I'm assuming you need a lot of resources. Oh, huh, that car battery. Vitamins. Disease resist and cure fatigue. Can I open the map? Yes, I can. Okay. I don't know how big the... Uh, world is. So where do I find the plant fibers? Punch grass, shrubs, and small stones. It's not... Oh. Oh, we are getting stuff from this. Cotton plant. Resources is complete. Craft stone axe. Stone axe. Craft W. How do I equip it? Huh. Press to harvest wood from trees and small stones from boulders. Oh, you can do both. Am I in combat? What's going on? No idea. Well, this is going to take a long time. Oh, but I'm getting wood already. I see. And harvest small stones as well. I might as well get all of the wood from this. If you get 900 wood from one tree... Or maybe you don't get that much. I think that's like the health of the tree. How much are we getting? 131. Okay, we get like two per. Oh, it's down in the bottom right. Sometimes we get two, sometimes we get one. Yeah, I get all the stone. Yeah, animations are okay. 
They're not amazing. Graphics are also okay. I wouldn't say they're bad. I wouldn't say they're great. Uh, primitive outfit. Oh. Huh. Okay. Select the primitive outfit. Oh. Press W to wear. Light armor rating. Stamina, mobility, max durability. Okay. Craft a wooden club. Wait, why is this stuff down here? Oh, because I'm guessing I'm overloaded. Uh. Wait, note. Uh, primitive bow. Okay. Oh, it takes a little bit of time to, to make these things. Okay, that's really weird. To pick something up, you can't click on it. You have to click and hold it. But then you can release the mouse button and it doesn't get released. You have to click again. That's a bit of an odd way of doing it. <clears throat> Let's drop this. What is this? Water. Okay, this is actual water, not murky water. We got some cotton. Let's drop that as well for now. Um... So what now? Gather feather. Oh, because we need to make arrows. Oh, God, what is up with that club? That's disgusting. So what is this note? How do I use it? Just a friendly reminder that you pay on time. Every time or there will be consequences. Next time we won't be so nice. Thanks for the gear, but you still owe us. See you soon, the Duke. What? Okay. Okay. I guess we owe someone money? Oh, it's a bird nest. Eggs and feather. So what happens if we're overloaded? I guess your stamina goes down faster, slowly and, and more and more. I can already craft an arrow. Ooh, what is this? Wiring. Learn to how to create your own generators and electrical powered items. Oh yeah, use that. Cement, small stones. Okay, uh, craft the arrow. Should I craft one or more? Challenges icon. Oh, wow. Well, that's, that's a lot. How do I... Range weapons are great. Some weapons have more ammo. So this is like a tutorial as well here. I don't know what these things give us. It's just XP as a reward. Good job, survivor. You have proved to be capable with much potential. We have marked your map with the nearest White River outpost location. There you will find a trader where you can buy and sell goods and trade stories with one of your friendly citizens. Welcome aboard, Noah. Who are these people? They're saying we have given you... Locate. Journey to settlement. Okay. Stone arrow ammo. Huh, okay. There's the feathers. <clears throat> the hell was that? Oh, it's a zombie. I don't care about you, zombie. There it is. Where do I go in? There. Close that. That's a nice little uh, survival settlement. Where's all the people? Wrecked feeds open. Hello. Put away your weapon, unless you'd like to die in my store. Sorry. Congratulations. Here's your reward. No. Sucker. Uh, okay. No, I sent you, eh? Well, you're going to have to show us your capabilities. Take the shovel and accept your first quest. May I see your inventory? You break any of my shit, you're paying double. So what should I sell? I don't even know what I should sell or not. There, I can sell them that. What are we getting? Eleven what? <laughs> what is that money? I don't know. Uh, recharge them in a powered battery bank. Interesting. Oh, there it is. Duke's Casino Token, I see. 
A Duke's Casino to, uh, coin. After the epidemic and war, three bra uh, these brass coins became the main currency for trading Navas game. Can be smelted in a forge to craft firearm ammunition. Huh. Crushed sand. I don't necessarily want to sell anything right now. Um... You gotta be the dumbest son of a bitch I've ever seen. But don't let the door hit you on your way out. Wait, special jobs? Intro buried supplies. I got work to do if you don't mind getting your hands dirty. Let's start you off with something a little easier. Go dig up the supplies nearby that one of my associates left for me. Don't forget you're going to need a shovel. Uh, let's get one thing straight. You're not working with me. You're working for me. Wow, well, real nice guy. Tracked with vending machine. Where's this guy getting power from? Probably solar cells or something. Head to rally point. Where's the rally point? Back there. Well, I'll take the feathers. I don't know why these uh, are on the floor. Oh, cement mixer. It's a destroyed cement mixer. Outfit your shop with forges work. We already have this one, so... I don't know. Hello? Yeah, that's right. Jesus. Where's my arrow? You lose the arrows when you shoot them? Damn it. Ugh. That sucks. What's the point of the bow then? How do you unequip items? You have to press a empty slot. This kind of sucks. What happened to this place? Seems like a fire broke out here. All right, let's see. We've got a shovel. Oh, start quest. Find White River Supplies X. I mean, it's here, right? Oh, we're getting clay from the ground. Okay. That's going to take a while. Uh, well, that wasn't it. Locate supplies nearby. Hmm. I like the fact that you're actually deforming the environment, but... I'm guessing this is partly so you can find the thing and also get some clay and stuff that you'll need later on. I'm assuming they wouldn't let you uh dig for nothing where the hell is it watch it's gonna be somewhere else it's not gonna be here oh you're getting closer to the treasure okay so now it's saying like well this poor moron doesn't know where to dig so we're gonna give him a hand or maybe i do need to dig lower I'm getting a lot of clay. Well, still not here. What is this freaking shovel supposed to be anyway? He gave it to me. Did he make it out of his freaking... I don't know. It's just a stone. And it's tied to a, to a stick. Oh, there we go. You're getting closer to the treasure. So I do need to dig deeper. Okay. I wonder if you can make moats like this. It would take a long time, but that's kind of cool. I'm getting tired. 
out of stamina. What is that? Oh, that's how visible I am. I guess. It's sound and visibility, I guess. Is this really that deep? Will I be able to get out of here? And why is this buried so deep? Well, most of this Let's Play is going to be just digging stuff, I guess. You're getting closer to the treasure. What do you mean? Oh, there it is. Holy moly. Who took all this effort to dig it so deep? So now, what happens if... What is it? White River Supplies, there it is. And Rotting Flesh, Murky Water, and an old sham sandwich. Ooh. Exactly. I wanted to say, what if I got stuck down here now with zombies? That wouldn't be the best idea. Hello. Yeah, that's right. Ooh. So they do drop loot. Cloth, heavy land. From the home repair enthusiast to the professional repairman, we've got you covered. Improves repair tool crafting skill. Blue, take that, and ammunition. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm definitely getting slower now. Because I'm a bit overloaded. Well, maybe that's just placebo. Ooh, repair kit. Return to the trader. Let's also get rid of the weapon so he doesn't say, I'm about your weapon away while I'm gonna... I'm gonna teach you a lesson. <clears throat> Come on, you can run. Is there a door here? Yes, there is. Out of stamina. So where's my hunger and thirst? Because <clears throat> I will obviously need to eat and drink. Oh, jeez. There, there's us. Um, oh, yeah, I forgot to show you. You can actually create your character. Stamina, water. There we go. Water and food. Why is that hidden behind these submenus? Am I allowed to be here? Okay. Lop that. You best keep clear of me. Well, I'll be danged. You really managed to pull through in a pinch. Thanks for digging up those supplies. Here's what I owe you: pipe machine gun bundle, pipe baton, pistol, shotgun. Mm, I like a shotgun. Strength perks. Perception. Agility. Intellect. Intellect. Robotics parts. Fortitude. Huh. I'll take a rifle, actually. May I see your bye. inventory? Or bye. Here's your, uh... No, he doesn't want the sandwich. Here's an egg. Paper can be used with other ingredients to make shotgun ammo, dynamite, and cigars. Crafted in lots of ten. Cha-ching! Thanks, buddy. So what do I do now? Ah, clear zombies, buried supplies, clear zombies, clear zombies, buried supplies. Let's make a pact. Uh, you do something for me, and maybe I won't kill you. No prove that you have what it takes to be a part of White River Runners. We need you to clear out the zombies at Mushroom Mining Company. Well, good luck. By the looks of it, you're gonna need it. So where do I build my base? Because I'm... I'm overloaded. That way. Where can I, can I store my stuff? What the hell was that? Oh. Because I tried taking the stone, and I guess that's stealing. There's a destroyed workbench. Destroyed forge. Oh. Outfit your shop with forges. Let's use that. Forged iron. Small stone. Mm-mm. I'm getting overloaded. Man. 
Well, uh, yeah, it's it's interesting. It certainly feels quite dated, to be completely honest. Um, but should be interesting. Let me know down in the comments below what you think about the game so far, if you'd like to see more of it. Ow! And if you would, well, we're going to continue with this. So thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons. And then we'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.